for the first time in its history, first time since the Spanish colonization, uh, Latin America is moving towards a degree of independence and also a degree of integration. The history of Latin America, Latin America is very sharply split between a tiny rich elite and huge poverty. Uh, and the rich elite, who are the only, have been the only active ones politically, uh, they, were not, they were oriented towards the colonial power. They were moving towards a degree of independence and towards a degree of integration. And the United States is terrified. Uh, just keeping the oil alone, it means that the energy resource, I mean, the major energy producer in the hemisphere is Venezuela. The U.S. kicked the British out under Wilson, Woodrow Wilson, it's known as Wilsonian idealism. They kicked the British out as soon as the oil age began because they knew that Venezuela had enormous oil resources. Uh, that meant supporting a bunch of utterly brutal dictators uh, while Venezuela became, uh, by 1928, the leading oil exporter in the world. It's remained uh, very high. Uh, Venezuela is now going towards independence, and the United States is frantic. Uh, that's why you have this hysteria about Chavez. Uh, it's not because he's attacking anyone or anything like that. Uh, it's hysteria because he's not following orders. Uh, it's kind of like Serbia, but much more serious because this is a big energy producer. Furthermore, he, he influences others. Uh, the major uh, uh, energy producer in South America, second to Venezuela, is Bolivia. Well, you know, it just happened there. Uh, they're moving towards independence as well. Uh, and, in fact, the whole region from Venezuela down to Argentina is pretty much out of control. 